Hey there, everybody. It's KYN, and welcome back to my Let's Play of uh, Commander King 4, or Secret of the Oracle. So last time, I uh, only did two more levels, uh, one of which was um, the level in which you can unlock the secret level yeah, by the um, the legit way of doing it, yeah, rather than do, like, say, cheat codes and whatnot. And, um, yeah, so unlock the secret there, and then uh, did the bonus level, but, um, or rather, the secret level. And that one uh, dedicated a lot of video time because I kept dying so much in that low, and I was forewarned ahead of time that it's a very, very hard low. And yes, um, after struggling so much with it, yeah, I could definitely attest to that. Yeah, it, and even the Keen Wiki itself uh, states that it's quite possibly the hardest low in the entire game. So, um, yeah, um, I think that it's definitely the very first time I've ever played it. And um, yeah, I think I remember the other lows. Uh, being not as bad as that one. So, uh, needless to say, the difficulty of the other lows don't come anywhere near as high as that one, uh, as the secret low. So, uh, yeah, in any case, we're pretty much uh, past the uh, hardest low of the entire game, which is completely completely optional. Yeah, it's not required in any way. And uh, there isn't really like any way you might have known about it, because, um, yeah, you probably like found out about it either through like, readings that you've done online, or you possibly just discovered it by accident somehow. Um, yeah. Honestly, I don't think I would have been able to discover it on my own. Yeah, whatsoever. Yeah. Um, I actually uh, read the wiki beforehand, yeah, quite some time ago. Yeah. Um, and I uh, found out about it that way. So, um, yeah. Um, but in any case, yeah, in case you're wondering how you access it, yeah, that's how. Yeah, or at least that's one of the ways that you can do it. Yeah, but, but which does not uh, resort to using cheat codes and whatnot. Yeah, the other way is through cheat codes, but um, yeah, I think um, that requires like um, that you uh, do a debug mode and whatnot, and then you just um, hit the appropriate keys, yeah, to um, to do so. Uh, because essentially on the map itself, um, yeah, it's surrounded by trees completely. And um, yeah, if you are wondering, no, you cannot like run or uh, walk uh, over the trees to... Uh, access that level. So, um, yeah, don't even try. Yeah, unless you activate the no clipping uh, Chico, I, I believe. I think that will allow you to get to that area. Yeah, and uh, play the low. But yes, um, that's pretty much what happened the last time. Yeah, just those two levels alone. Yeah, uh, Pyramid of the Moons and, and uh, Pyramid of the Forbidden. So those were the only two levels that we did the last time. Yeah, mostly because I kept dying so much in the uh, second level and yeah. That one took a very long time, but we finally made it. Yeah, after dying so much and um, struggling through many areas of the low. Um, yeah, I did watch a video early this morning where um, someone someone was able to do it on hard difficulty without like um, saving at all. So uh, yes, I imagine that it is definitely possible, but um, I'm I'm thinking most likely it it requires like uh, precognition. I think that's what they call it. And in that you essentially have to like study the map ahead of time in order to like know where the houses are and and whatnot. And so that uh when you actually do the run, um, yeah, it will allow you to do it flawlessly and um be able to um complete the law without um saving at any point. So yeah, I definitely gotta say it's it's most impressive, but um yeah, at the same time though, um to risk or rather to minimize the risk of dying and whatnot. Uh, the user um, ended up skipping a lot of um, uh, the um, uh, uh, one area. Yeah, the one that uh, that's the one in which it was pretty much over a tar pit and whatnot. Yeah, uh, I think that was like the um, third to last area. Yeah, before you finally can complete the law and everything. So yeah, uh, <laughs> just know that it took a very long time, but we finally made it uh, to that low. And so um, I think pretty much at this point now we are down to the final five levels of the game. Yeah, there's five more levels remaining. Yeah, I know that there's... I think there's the two pyramid levels, and then finally the three uh, levels that are on the islands. Yeah, I think those are the only ones left. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, and I haven't forgotten anything else. So, anyway, we're just going to go ahead and continue with the Let's Play here. So, let's go ahead and load up the uh, save file here, which I'm pretty sure is the final one. Yes, okay, yeah. Because we are now back to the main part of the uh, map here. So there's one at the Pyramid Lows, and there's another one over here. Uh, I think I'm just going to go down in order, so... Yeah, this is the next one after the other one, the Pyramid of the Moons. So this one has a sun icon. 
move silently into pyramid of shadows. Okay, um, let's go ahead and save the game here, even though we're not like really in danger, I don't think. But uh, just to be sure, let's just do it. Ooh, we were running pretty low on ammo there. We, don't, we only had like three shots remaining, I think. Um... somewhere. Oh, uh, no. Oh, we were actually just further to the right of low. Okay. So, in that case, let's go ahead and slide down the pole here. Yeah, I think we're back to the original three. or something. Uh, let's go ahead and save again. Really, where are all the other ammo? Definitely be nice if there was some more ammo somewhere. Um, let's see, there isn't really much of interest there. Um, we'd be down to one shot remaining. Ah, uh, there's more ammo now, but. I'm able to get the, the extra ammo. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it, he turned tail. Dude, go away. Yikes. Yeah, thank god there's, there's more ammo here. Yeah, and more down there. Yeah, now, how do we... ...get further into the low and everything? Oh, it seems that we go over there, I think. Okay, 
Let's go ahead and save here. Was stupid in me. Oh, yeah, I see where we are now. Yeah, and I believe this just gets us back to the very start of the low. Yeah. Save here since we are over pit here. Okay. Yeah. So it goes down. It just falls like you um, stand on it and everything. Um. Nope. Bad timing. Bad timing. Bad timing. Yeah, yeah, it looks like better. Jump on it. Just in case I screw up. Okay, um. Yeah, there you go.
Darn it. It's always those sky passes. Okay, maybe I should have saved it before I went on there. Darn it. Yeah, you really have to get lucky that uh, none of those sky pressers are coming to like. Oh, you ah, uh, and that was too bad of me to make a jump. Ay, ay, ay. Ah, darn it! Seriously, what is with that? I'm just gonna wait another round then. And that didn't work. <sighs> Seriously, And we actually we miraculously survived that. Save that. That way, I don't have to like, squish the sky pass again.
so much for rescuing me. I'll return to the Oracle Chamber immediately. Good idea, Gramps. Okay, that one wasn't too bad. But even then, <laughs> still ended up dying a lot there. Alright, and now to the final pyramid level here. Reverend Lee enters the pyramid to goes to seeing something. I don't know how, or rather, I don't remember how the, this level is compared to the other pyramid ones. I think these guys are harmless, but they like steal stuff from you. Where's that platform now? Shoot those guys. That's what you even do anyway. Yeah, it's not that one.
Oh, oh yeah, that's what I meant to do. Yeah, it was just simply sound of one of those deeps and light disappearing. Yeah, I should actually make a save file. Yeah, once we're over the spikes pit. Seems that we have to like find a door. I think it was like a red door or something. Bye. 
does make me wonder if, um, somehow one of the thieves, like, uh, rendered the low impossible or something. I don't think it's likely, though. Here, yeah, I just simply missed an error somewhere. Bye. 
on it. Alright, let's go and save here before we drop down. Does the platform go all the way this far? Yeah, the music stopped temporarily because, yeah, I was trying to, like, uh, move the window up so I can see how much time we've been recording. Yeah, it's been close to 40 minutes now. Oh, and it does come. Oh shoot! Wow! Even I cannot land on the platform correctly. This so just has to go a long way.
but was just following us from below. Wow, where's that platform? There it is. Uh oh. Oh, no, no, no. Ah, that was stupid of me. A book, I see. All right, and let's save it here so that way we don't have to do the very long wait. Now we have to wait for it. It's a very large pit, apparently. escape. Uh, let's just return to the game first and then... Alrighty, now we can save it. Just try to minimize the amount of waiting that we can, that we need to do. Darn it! Really, I'm trying to grab onto that ledge. that we made it to the end there. So it is wide, but um, yeah. Not as like wide as I thought that. It only feels that way because it's a very slow moving platform.
All right. Yeah, let's go ahead and save it. Oh, thank you so much for rescuing me. I'll return to the Oracle Chamber immediately. May the road rise to meet your feet, Mr. Member. Alrighty, so that um, completes the last of the pyramid levels. Yeah, these uh, pyramid levels aren't anywhere near as long as the um, uh, secret level one. Yeah, granted, uh, maybe this one was... Um, it might have been the one before this one. Uh, they were still challenging in their own ways, but yeah, they definitely aren't anywhere near as long as the secret level one. So anyway, um, I think what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go ahead and make a stop as much as I would love to keep on going. Uh, because I think we're down to the final three levels. And I think what I have planned is uh, basically I think I want to do um, the two levels that are not the underwater one first uh, in one video. And then maybe just finish off the LP with um, the underwater level just because it's like pretty iconic. And as I mentioned before, it's kind of like the dope fish theme because um, that's the music that plays and yeah, it's called Eat Your Veggies. Yeah, that we already heard on some other levels, such as the one where we needed to find the swimsuit and everything. Uh, but yeah, I think that's pretty much what I plan for the rest of the videos in the LP. So anyway, you're just going to have to tune in to see how the rest of the, this plays out. And uh, yeah, it's been a while, somewhat of a while uh, and long journey here, but well. Um, that's all because I'm doing this game on hard difficulty for the river, for very first time, and I totally did not expect the, uh, the lows to be this difficult, yeah. Uh, but then again, it is released from the same company that did uh, Bottom Menace, and, which is another game yeah, that was apparently made with the Commander Keen engine, so um, yeah. I guess I should have expected that, given that I've already LP'd um, Bob Menace some time ago. Yeah, I think it might have been two years ago? Maybe last year, or possibly even the year before that. But, uh, yeah. Um, in any case, yeah, I guess the sharp difficulty, I should have expected that. Yeah, yeah, with hard difficulty for this game. But, well, yeah. Uh, so this is how it is to, like, beat the lows on hard difficulty. But at the same time, you can, like, use this somewhat of a cheap way, cheap way to, like, um, make up for, like, um, the, t the many times that you might die by uh, infinitely saving and loading each time because apparently save files do work properly here and yeah you could totally take advantage of it yeah, like I've been doing yeah, throughout the LP yeah n now that I've uh, figured it out and um, found out about it so yeah so anyway yeah we're gonna go ahead and make a stop here so tune in next time for when um, I let's play more of Commander King 4 Secret of the Oracle so hope you enjoyed this video of the let's play and I'll see you all next time